Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? And what we have here, this follows when we have a raised to the power m minus n, which is the same thing as a raised to the power m over a raised to the power n. And this here, I write it as 9 raised to the power x over 9 squared equals to 90 on this side. This here we have 9 raised to the power of x over 9 square 9 times 9, which is 81, equals to here we can write this as 90 over 1. The next step here we cross multiply, that is, we have 9 raised to the power x times 1, same thing as 9 raised to the power of x equals to 90 times 81 here. The next step here we take the log on both sides. And this here we have log 9 raised to the power x equals to log 90 times 81 here. Then here we apply the power law of log What well, we have log m raised to the power p the same thing as p log m. And this here. We have x log 9 equals to log 90 times 81 on this side. And here, this follows the law of log n. When we have log a times b, this same thing as log a plus log b. This, and write this, and we have x log 9 equals to log 90 plus log 81. Then next step, divide both side by log 9. That is, divide this side by log 9. Also, divide this side by log 9. That is, here log 9 cancelled each other here. We have x equals to log 90 over log 9 plus log 81 over log 9 then from here we can write 81 as 9 times 9 as 9 square this here we have x equals to log 90 over log 9 plus log 9 squared over log 9. The next step here, we apply the power of log 9. 2 comes here and we have x equals to log 90 over log 9 plus 2 log 9 over log 9. That is here, log 9 cancelled each other. We have to left here. That is x now equals to log 90 over log 9 plus 2. Then, also here, we can write 90 as 9 times 10, which implies here we have x equals to log 9 times 10 over log 9 plus 2. Then this also follows the law of logarithm. We have x equals to log 9 plus log 10 over log 9 plus 2. Then we separate. This is the two fractions. We have x equals to log 9 over log 9 plus log 10 over log 9 plus 2. For this here, also log 9 cancel each other. We have one left. And we have x equals to 1 plus 2, which is 3 plus. Also here, 
of log 10 over log 9. Then, next step here, we can write 10 as 2 times 5. And here we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 times 5 over log 9. This also follows the law of logarithm. That is, we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 9. Then, separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 9 plus log 5 over log 9 which implies also 9 can be written as 3 times 3 which is 3 squared and what we have here becomes x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 3 squared plus log 5 over log 3 squared and we apply the power of log in here two comes here and also here we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over 2 log 3 plus log 5 over 2 log 3 that is, yeah, we can write this as x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 times log 2 over log 3 plus also 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 3. Then, here we apply change of base from what we have log a over log b which is the same thing as log a to base b as is here we have x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 log 2 base 3 plus 1 over 2 log 5 base 3 then we bring this together as one fraction this 3 over 1 and we have x equals to the same here that's 2 and here this becomes 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3. As this we have the value of x here. 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Then let's check here. We just satisfy this even problem. As this we solve the things, the value of x here. Which is x equals to 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. And here what we have becomes 9 base to power 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 minus 2 here this is equals to 90 on this side then from here we bring this part together as one and this here we have 2 over 1 this is because 9 is to power SCMA that's 2 here we have 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 minus oh yeah now this is equals to 90 on this side. Then here, yeah, we have 6 minus 4. That's 2. This is we have 9 raised to the power 2. Plus log 2 is 3. Plus log 5 is 3. All over 2. This is equals to 90 on this side. Then also here, yeah, we can write 9 as 3 squared. Which is raised to the power. 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 
on the word 2 is this equals to 90 on this side. This power multiplies. Here two cancelled each other. We have 3 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3. Is it equals to 90 on this side? We apply the law of indices. When well, we have a raised to power n plus n, it's same thing as a raised to power n times a raised to power n. That is, here we have 3 square. And still raised to power log 2 base 3. And still raised to power log 5 base 3. Is it equals to 90 on this side? And 3 square here we have 9. Then this follows and we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. And this here we have 2 and times 5. This is equals to 90 on this side. This here we have 2 times 5, 10 times 9, that's 90, equals to 90 from here. That is left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 6 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 satisfies this given problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to step subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class, and bye for now.